Hello, I'm here today with Sister Pat. Sister Pat, how long have you been coming to a food pantry? About three years. Three years. So you've you've worked in the food pantry, or how how did you what how did you find out about food pantry? Well, I heard it through other people, and I came up here, and it was a blessing. I got food, and it's a blessing that I can work here now, and I think it's a, be a blessing for other people if they would come and help and be served also. All right, so you would recommend that other people get involved in food pantry then? Yes, I would. All right, well, thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Sylvia and she heads up our food pantry ministry and today we're going to ask her what her vision is for 2015. For 2015 I would because we're growing so fast we, had, we did 70 families today so um, I would like to see more help and uh, just something that where we can um, help each other to help Christ. Uh, we need more help with the food pantry. We need ministers to help you know, not just to feed their soul, to feed their bodies, but also to feed their souls. A pastor is going to help us to raise some money and stuff to help so we can buy what we need for the food pantry because uh, some, most sometimes we don't have enough food to go through. And these families are uh, with children. They're, they're elderly. They're just trying to make ends meet with Social Security from the community. I mean, it's, it's not just Vandalia. It's Brownstown, Ramsey, St. Elmo, Chauvenier. I mean, they come from, from all around here, and, and it's, it's getting to be a, a more and more growing need. So would you say that we not only need volunteers, but we're going to need more supplies? Yes. So like I said, the, the supplies are, like, we had 70 families, and it's, it, they're depleted. We make uh, a trip to Bloomington, and also two trips to uh, what they call College Hill. And uh, sometimes we get plenty, and other times we just, it's whatever they, they, they give us and what our prisoners give us. And today, if it hadn't been for our prisoners given to us, we wouldn't have probably had enough. So yes, um, we need more volunteers, 
you can't volunteer at the, at the food pantry, maybe you can bring in a, a case of canned goods or just anything that is that won't uh, rain within two weeks. Even like toilet paper or we had, had someone donate, uh, they went to Sisters and bought all the hats and gloves that they had. We, we try to help as much as we can and that helps not just their physical body but also it gives them hope. We want to fill them, when they walk in the doors at Family Worship Center, we want them to fill it with what we feel on, on Sunday. We want to feel the joy and that God's here and He'll never leave them and they just need to be here with us. So by helping Food Pantry, you're showing the love of Christ. You're being His hands and His feet to the community, but also to it serves families inside the doors of Family Worship Center. Yes. Yeah. I, I know the ones that help me all the time. We, it, it gives you in here, you know that that's what Christ wants for you to do.